I'm going to present my research on acoustic cell concentration using a hybrid PDMS device. Blood is one of the typical body fluids composed of red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets, and plasma. Also, blood contains disease-related cells, which are useful for a clinical diagnosis. Conventional method for cell manipulation is centrifugation. However, it requires bulky and expensive equipment and large sample volume. To overcome these limitations, microfluidic techniques have been used as alternatives. Acoustofluidics is one of the microfluidic techniques. It has advantages of non-invasiveness, simple use, low power consumption, and easy integration with other microfluidic techniques. Using piezoelectric transducers, Berg acoustic wave can be simply generated at low cost. This can be used to manipulate cells in microfluidic channel. However, Berg acoustic wave technique has limitations of requiring silicon-based fluidic device. Actually, PDMS is the most popular material for microchannel fabrication these days, but PDMS is not suitable for bulk acoustic wave device because PDMS can attenuate the acoustic waves due to its elasticity. Therefore, in this study, to address the current limitations, a hybrid PDMS channel containing an embedded glass plate at the top of the microchannel was introduced as shown in figure 1. Acoustic waves from the piezoelectric transducer can be reflected through the glass plate and longitudinal waves can be transmitted back to the fluid in the microchannel. To validate the use of the hybrid PDMS device for acoustic cell manipulation, Acoustic trapping of red blood cells in the region with and without embedded glass was evaluated. As shown in Figure 2, once a piezoelectric transducer was actuated, red blood cells were trapped in the region where the glass plate was embedded at the channel top. After validation, Fluorescent particles and cells with different sizes were used for work acoustic wave-based concentration, as shown in Figure 3 here. 10 micrometer particles, red blood cells, bacteria, and even 700 nanometer particles could be captured in the hybrid PDMS device in 10 minutes. Due to the relatively small size of bacteria and 700 nanometer particles, 10 micrometer particles were captured first as seed particles, and those small size bacteria and 7 nanometer particles could be captured by secondary acoustic waves generated by those seed particles. In conclusion, Using our hybrid device, it is possible to use PDMS microchannel for bulk acoustic wave-based cell trapping. This enables the use of microchannels with various designs at low price, and also the local control of acoustic wave at the confined region with the embedded glass can be achieved. Thank you very much.